Today I'm going to be showing you how to calibrate the water activity meter using pre-mixed fluid. So if you don't want to mix your own stuff, we can use this. You do want to have clean hands or use gloves. And we can see the solution is a 0.75, so we should get a 0.75. You can also see on here that depending on the temperature that we might get a different reading. So it's 0.75 pretty much across the board until you get to about 59 degrees Fahrenheit or 15 degrees Celsius. So hopefully you won't be working in those conditions. We want our testing cup. And we want to fill it so it is just about under half full. We want to hold the base because this is magnetic and we don't want to shoot up into the sensor. So just hold that, drop it on. And now we're going to let it sit for about a half hour. Okay, so it's been about a half hour, so let's see where we are at. So we are getting a reading of 0.74, so that is low by 0.01, which is pretty accurate. But let's make it even better. So if you press and hold this button for three seconds, it's going to shut off. If you hold it for seven seconds, it will go into calibration mode. Okay, and we can see we have a correction of 0 0.02 on there already because I had previously calibrated that up by 0 0.02. So now I'm going to reduce that to 0 0.01. So in the battery compartment, we got two buttons here. We want to press on the little orange piece right in there. That is the actual button. The left side goes up, the right side goes down. So we will hear a beep. That means that we should be at 0 0.01 now. So this should be correctly calibrated. So I'm going to set that, and then we will shut this back off. And we'll let that sit again and then recheck it. So let's check that again. And there we go. Perfect 0.75. So very easy to calibrate. If you don't want to make the solution, just get this pre-made stuff. I just got to clean this guy up and that will be ready to go.